Welcome to my channel. Today's video is, comp is comparing WP Rocket versus Rabbit Loader. I've been using WP Rocket for a couple of years now and I love it. Uh, Rabbit Loader is a little bit newer uh, company. They uh, suppose a, a lot of people say they are faster than WP Rocket and I could say it's 50-50. It's, uh, because what, how they process um, uh, your page speed optimization is different than how WP Rocket does. Uh, what R Rabbit Loader does is really uh, kind of crawl your site and then optimize it. Um, but it's sometimes it's very restrictive. Let me kind of show you what that means. Here is an example. Uh, I've updated uh, the Rabbit Loader WordPress plugin, uh, but the origin server is blocking requests with zero too many requests, and it just stops. I've whitelisted their IP address that they provided right here. Did not work. Uh, the the other thing is it takes them about 24 to 48 hours for them to completely uh, go through your whole site and optimize optimize it, but all of my sites, maybe only one site was able to finish the whole crawl within that time frame. Um, again, I've whitelisted their IP um, from uh, Cloudways, Hostinger, I have a security uh, plugin, Web Totem, um, I have my ghosts. Um, <clears throat> so I really completely, even Cloudflare. I whitelisted their IP and still have issues. Uh, they, they still have issues with this uh, for most of the hosting providers. So for you to <clears throat> even use Rabbit Loader, you need to have a compatible hosting provider. And like I said, I use Cloud, Cloudways, Hostinger. I also have like a lifetime deal website, um, web hosting that's really cheap um, so I wanted to kind of compare how it works and I would say um, I went back to WP Rocket because this whole issue is just too much headache um, I mean the price comparison It's so what the what Rabbit Loader provides is optimization, CDN, image optimization, all for <clears throat> zero. You have CD, CDN bandwidth, and et cetera, et cetera. Their name is showing pricing. That's weird. Okay. That is weird. For a single site, uh, with WP Rocket, you do need um, WP Rocket and Imagify. Okay, so for if you have a single site, it's forty nine dollars a year. Uh, with Imagify, you're looking at four five dollars a month. So that's kind of, well, let's see, 49, 4, 99 times 12. That's about $109 a year versus rabbit loaders. I don't know how much it is. When it comes to speed optimization, don't go for free. Go for premium. There's no other solution. Uh, if you want to hire someone 
to create you a brand new WordPress site with just basic HTML, all of that, and then you want to optimize your images and things like that, go right ahead. But you're paying for a service that you need uh, in today's world, in today's uh, mobile first and uh, core web vitals and et cetera. So I wouldn't recommend going the free route. And this is, but let, yeah, let's go back to Rabbit Loader versus WP Rocket. So let me show you my first example. This is Rabbit Loader on the left, which had 34 uh, in Core Web Vitals. With WP Rocket, is 47. So WP Rocket wins on this round. The next one here to the left, Rabbit Loader again, 37, 80. Uh, it still hasn't fully optimized the next gen with the Magify just yet, since I had to activate WP Rocket again by removing ro uh, Rabbit Loader. Here's another site, 55 in performance, 77 with Rocket Loader, 55 with Rabbit Loader. Uh, so 55 with Rabbit Loader, 77 with WP Rocket. Here is the outlier, 38 in performance. It has a crazy JavaScript Elementor uh, theme website. Rabbit Loader did well, but obviously the blocking time is horrible. But in the overall con first content paint, uh, large content paint. And then cumulated layout shift are the main contributors. But here you can see spe uh, speed index uh, and the blocking time and then time to interactive is beneficial. So, and mind you, this is only with the, uh, on the right WP Rocket. I've only installed WP Rocket and Imagify. I don't have any CDN. I don't have the Rocket CDN or Cloudflare or anything where Rabbit Loader supposedly had CDN, image optimization, and the whole optimization. It's a total package, okay? So 38.14. And last test I've done is 54, no, this is the second to the last. Uh, so 52 with Rabbit Loader, 70 with WP Rocket. Here you can see one of the site fully functional with Rabbit Loader, uh, with CDN and everything, 99. And this is all mobile. Uh, and then WP Rocket is 80 uh, without CDN. So 99 with CDN, with everything with Rabbit Loader. This is WP Rocket without CDN, but Imagify and WP Rocket. So I hope that kind of helped you understand the difference between WP Rocket and Rabbit Loader. Um, with Rabbit Loader, you have to try it out. Uh, whether you want to create a staging site or do it on your own site, you could change it where you could install it on your site and then make sure that you, you're the only one who sees the changes and then you can switch it to so that everyone else could see the, the changes as well. But you want to see the, the logs. Uh, if it's running correctly, if there's any restrictions with your hosting provider, if you uh, whitelisted your uh, their IP address and it's still blocking, then you wouldn't want to use Rabbit Loader. I just ha got fed up with Rabbit Loader not working at all of my hosting providers. So I'm just going straight to WP Rocket, and WP Rocket is still the best in compar uh, comparing with multiple sites that I have, and I've tasted, tested all of them. So the result, WP Rocket Rinse versus Rabbit Loader. I hope this helped. 
if you want to use Rock, WP Rocket, please use my affiliate link below. Other than that, if you have any questions, leave a comment and have a good one.